what they've done is something even worse. They've turned, they've turned the legal system, they've turned the legal system, whether it is bankruptcy, whether it is taking one somebody's law license, whether it's debanking, and they have the greatest president this nation's had since Abraham Lincoln, and they're they're about to put him. By the way, you know on July on the 11th of July they're going to sentence him for multiple years in prison. You understand that, right? You understand what they're doing in New York, and then they're going to limit they're going to limit how he can travel, how it's going to be court supervised. Why is that? To steal the election, to steal the election. Under no circumstances can they have the Trump the Trump administration take back over. They can't have MAGA rule the country. They don't care about this election. They don't care how many votes we get. They're going to fight us every step of the way. Look, it's between now and November 5th, and what Charlie and the team here and you guys are going through these workshops and get out the vote and chase the ballots, and voter integrity is everything. But just winning in November is just the first step. Then from November 5th to the 6th, Jamie Raskin is going to try to steal election on January 6th. He's going to, they're already talking about right now, they're already going to say President Trump's an insurrectionist. And we will never certify an election of an insurrectionist. Raskin talks about it all the time. That's why we have to take the House even by just one seat. And then, and then, and then, starting on high noon, on the 20th of January, when President Trump takes his hand off the King James Bible,